Welcome back your time 812 this morning. Today is Colorado's largest single day of giving. It's Colorado Gives Day and it's the perfect day to help a local nonprofit. This morning, owner, owners of Kitchen One for One, Chris Cacullen and Mark Sunderhues join us live. It's a nonprofit food truck that delivers food to those in need. Let's start off by saying good morning, guys. Good morning. Good morning. Thank you for having us. Absolutely. So December marks your fifth anniversary. Let's start by saying congratulations for that. But we want you all to tell us about this new program called Guest Chef Taco. You just launched it. Yeah, how about it? It's a great program. We're real excited about it. We had a, a, a friend donate 380 pounds of shrimp and we're going out and partnering with restaurants to create a Guest Chef Taco. This month is Tamayo. Uh, down in Larimer Square, and they're doing a, we're doing an amazing taco on our truck that they created, uh, and then they're serving the same in their restaurant and donating part of the proceeds back to us. Oh, that shrimp sounds amazing. You know, I'm a pescatarian, so I'm all on board with those shrimp tacos. So tell us about who you <laughs> serve and why. Yeah, when we started this out, the whole intention was to serve incredible food to people Indeed. So we're serving around the metro area. We serve down in what we call Shelter City at St. Francis Shelter and then a number of uh, local churches that we're partnered with. All right. And we always ask the question, you know, why is it so important to give back? Man, I tell you, you know, we, we give back. We're a faith based ministry and we give back mm -hmm. because that's what we're told to do. Uh, and, you know, we've we've been blessed. And so we want to cast that blessing on and bless other people. Yeah, and we think in this in this tough time, there's a lot of people who just aren't capable or they're ashamed to reach out. So we're also trying to give them conversation with a lot of dignity and bless the volunteers that we have, which is now up to about 700. And it allows them to uh, get out and interact with people, not only in need, but sometimes simply people that want or need a conversation with someone. Yeah, and you know what, under what Mark is saying, you know, we don't just give amazing food, but we build hope, we build relationships uh, and let people know that they're loved, they're needed and they're wanted. Absolutely amazing. You guys are doing so much for so many people. I'm sure there's a lot of people who are going to want to join in. So our next question, how can people get involved? Well, you can follow us on social media, Facebook and Instagram, first of all. Um, you can click on you can go to kitchen1for1.com and you can click on the the donate button if you if you feel called to give on this amazing gives day uh, or you can volunteer with us and uh, as, as Mark mentioned we've got 700 volunteers so we're hoping we can raise a lot of money so that next year we can really expand our events yeah, and our volunteering really ranges from coming out and serving helping us prepare food we have a commercial commissary where we prepare food all the way to just walking the line and having conversations with people again, that maybe they're lonely this time of year, or maybe they just would enjoy a friendly face talking with them. Yeah. All right, Mark and Chris, congratulations again on five years. And we just want to say thank you for, you know, stopping by and talking with us this morning. Have a good day. Thank you for thank having you us. Thank you so much. Thank you. 